Hello children, I am Priyanka and I am your mentor. Today we will start with the chapter number 5 that is the southern plateaus and islands. Let's kick start. Which of the following statements about plateaus is incorrect? Second, which of the following statements about island is correct? The Southern Plateau. A plateau has a flat top and steep sides. Since it looks like a table, a plateau is called a table land. The Southern Plateaus are located to the south of the Northern Plains. They are triangular in shape. The surface of the plateau region is rocky and uneven. The southern plateaus are surrounded by the Aravli hills on its northwest, the Rajmahal hills on its northeast, the eastern ghats on its east, and the western ghats on its west. Most of the rivers in the southern plateaus are not as long as those in the northern plains. They however flow with great speed on their way. They from waterfalls. Waterfall. When a river or a stream fall from the edge of a mountain or a plateau, it forms a waterfall. The Narmada river valley roughly divides the plateau's region in two parts. First, the central highlands, the northern part. And the second one is the Deccan Plateau, the southern part. The Central Highlands. The Central Highlands is divided into two parts. Malwa Plateau. This plateau forms the northwest part of the Central Highlands. Parts of Rajasthan and Madhya Pradesh lie in this plateau. Its major cities are Gwalior, Indore and Bhopal. This plateau is rich in black soil but lacks in minerals. Chota Nagpur Plateau This plateau forms the northeast part of the central highlands. Parts of Jharkhand, Orissa, Chhattisgarh and Bihar lie in this plateau. Ranchi, Hazaribagh, Singhbhum and Manbhum are its main cities. The plateau is rich in coal which is used in converting iron into steel. Other minerals found here are iron, mica and manganese. Chota Nagpur plateau has many major industries like coal industries, mines, steel industries, diamond mines and wood products. Bukaro and Bhilai are the famous steel plants of this plateau. The Deccan Plateau The Deccan Plateau extends from river Narmada up to the southern tip of peninsular India. The states of Chhattisgarh, partly Odisha, partly Maharashtra, Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Kerala and Tamil Nadu lie in this plateau. Anaimuddi is the highest peak in this region. Rivers. Rivers of this plateau that flow eastward are Mahanadi, Godavari, Krishna and Kaveri. Rivers Tapi and Narmada flow westward. All the rivers depend on rain for water and usually dry up in summers. Godavari is the longest river in the Deccan Plateau. Waterfalls Many rivers in the Deccan Plateau from waterfalls. Some of the famous waterfalls are Jog Falls in Karnataka and Hoginakal Fall in Tamil Nadu. Rich in Minerals The Deccan Plateau is rich in minerals. Major mineral ores found in this area are iron ore, mica, diamond, basalt and granite. 
Golconda area in Telangana is famous for gold, diamond and other precious metals. Black soil. Most of the Deccan Plateau has black soil which is best suited for cultivation of cotton, rice, sugarcane, oil seeds and millets. Rich in forest. The forest of the Deccan Plateau are source of valuable woods like teak, sal and sandalwood. We also get rubber, tea, coffee and spices from them. Many industries like those of timber, firewood, charcoal and bamboo products are forest based. Main cities. The main cities of the Deccan Plateau are Bengaluru, Hyderabad, Mysore, Uti, Nagpur, Belgao, Warangal and Pune. Features of the state of the Southern Plateau. Let's know about the feature of some of the main states of the Southern Plateau. Telangana Location Bordered by Maharashtra and Chhattisgarh in the north, Karnataka in the west, Andhra Pradesh in the southeast and the northeast. Climate Hot and dry, semi-arid area, mild and dry winter, average high temperature in summer and average rainfall. Economy Agriculture based rice main food crop. Other crops cotton, sugarcane, mango and tobacco. Sunflower and peanuts gained recent momentum. Languages Telugu and Urdu. Tourist places Salar Jung Museum, Charminar, Nehru Zoological Park, Falak Numa Palace, Thousand Pillar Temple, Bhadra Chalam Temple and Medak Church. Main Cities Warangal, Sikandrabad, Karim Nagar, Nizamabad and Hyderabad. Festivals Ugadi, Vijayadashmi, Makar Sankranti, Guru Purav, Dipavli, Hanuman Jayanti, Bonalu and Bakrid. Special Features 28 in the newest state of India, famous for its Bidri work, Mittal Handicraft. Kuchipudi is the most popular dance in this state. Andhra Pradesh Location Bordered by Telangana in the northwest, Chhattisgarh in the north, Odisha in the northeast, Karnataka in the west, Tamil Nadu in the south, and Bay of Bengal in the east. Climate Heavy rains, mild winter, and fluctuating summer temperature between 20 degrees Celsius and 41 degrees Celsius. Economy Based on agriculture and livestock, rice ball of India, fertile and owing to Godavari, Krishna and Tungabhadra rivers, main crops, rice, wheat, jowar, bajra, maize, millets, pulses, oil seeds, cotton, sugarcane, mango, nuts and tobacco. Languages Telugu and Urdu. Tourist places Golconda, Hussain Sagar Lake, Tirupati Temple, and Simhashalam Temple. Main cities Vishakhapatnam, Vijayawada, Tirupati, and Guntur. Festivals Ugadi, Telugu New Year, Makar Sankranti, Mahashivratri. Dipavali, Bakrid, and Christmas. Special features Kuchipudi Dance, IT Center, and Vishakhapatnam Port. Now it's time for tits and bits. Uti is the only place in South India which has snowfall and is also nicknamed as Kashmir of South. 
Now Karnataka location. Karnataka is bordered by the Arabian Sea in the west, Goa in the northwest, Maharashtra in the north, Telangana in the northeast, Andhra Pradesh in the east and Kerala in the southwest. Climate Dry and warm, hot in summer, heavy rainfall, pleasant winter. Economy Agriculture and industries Industries Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, BHEL, BEML and HMT. Languages Kannada, Urdu, Konkani, Tullu and Kodava. Tourist places Gol Gumbas, Bijapur, Keshava Temple, Mysore Palace, Jog Falls, Shri Krishna Mat Temple, Udipi and Marikamba Temple, Sirsi. Main cities Bangaluru, Mysore, Manipal, Hubli, Gulbarga, Bijapur, Hassan and Bileri. Festivals Makar Sakranti, Ugadi, Ganesh Chaturthi, Dashera and Patada Kal Dance Festival. Special features Silk industry, Bangaluru, Silicon Valley of India, Kolar has gold mines. Yaksha Ganga is a popular dance drama. Tamil Nadu Location Southernmost state surrounded by Andhra Pradesh on the north, Karnataka and Kerala on the west, Indian Ocean on the south and Bay of Bengal on the east. Climate Hot in summer, pleasant in winter, average rainfall. Economy Based on agriculture and industries, rice and turmeric, main agriculture products. Industries Ashok Leyland, Royal and Field, TAFE, Tractors, Hyundai, Ford, BMW, Nissan, Renault. Languages Tamil, Kannada, Malayalam and Urdu languages spoken. Main festivals Pongal, Shivratri, Ramanavmi, Krishna Jayanti, Kanthuri, Dipavli and Kavadi. Main cities Chennai, Coimbatore, Madurai, Tiruchirapalli and Salem. Tourist places Minakshi Amman Temple, Madurai, Vivekanand Rock Memorial, Kapaleshwar Temple, Brihadeshwara Temple, Tanjore, Marina Beach, Kodai Canal Lake, Seashell Museum, and Suruli Falls. Special features Arod, the world's largest producer of turmeric, Kawadi Attam dance. Bharat Natyam dance, Gopuram and Tanjore paintings. The islands. There are two big islands group. These are Andaman and Nicobar Islands and Lakshadweep. Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Andaman and Nicobar Island are in the Bay of Bengal. The 10 degree channel separates the Andaman from the Nicobar Islands. The islands in this group are hilly. Rice is the main crop in the Andaman Islands. Coconut and areca nut are grown in the Nicobar Islands. Fishing and farming are the main occupations. Some people also make the shell and wooden handicrafts. Most people speak Bangla. The beautiful beaches and the cellular jail are major tourist attractions. Lakshadweep Lakshadweep is a group of islands in the Arabian Sea. These islands are flat. Coconut is the main crop grown here. Coir extracted from coconut is an important industry. Fishing is the main occupation. 
most people speak Malayalam. Many tourists visit these islands. Now children, it's time to looking back. The southern plateaus are triangular in shape with rocky and uneven land. The Narmada river valley roughly divides the plateau region in two parts the central highlands and the Deccan Plateau. The Deccan Plateau extends from river Narmada up to the southern tip of peninsula India. Godavari is the longest river in the Deccan Plateau. The forests of the Deccan Plateau are source of valuable woods like teak, sal and sandalwood. Fishing and farming sorry, fishing Farming, making shell, wooden handicrafts are the main occupation of the people of Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Fishing and koi making are the main occupations of the people of Lakshadweep. Now, children, it's time to take your leave. Bye. We'll meet in the next chapter.